if he reads one sloka his life will be successful if he reads one sloka one word this is such nice thing destiny and karma students some scientists argue that there are several souls within each body they use the earthworm as an example if you cut it in half both parts will live they say this proves that two souls occupy the original worm's body shila prabhupada no it is simply that a new soul has come to occupy the other half of the worm's body dr singh must the spirit soul necessarily have a body either material or spiritual shila prabhupada the soul already has a spiritual body which the material body covers my material body grows upon me my spiritual body but my material body is unnatural the real body is spiritual i am accepting various bodies that are unnatural to my constitution my real constitutional position is to be the servant of krishna as long as i do not come to that position i remain a servant of matter and get many material bodies according to the laws of material energy i get one body and then give it up i desire something else and again get another body this process is going on under the strict laws of material nature people think they are completely they completely control their destinies but they are always under nature's law of karma prakriti kriyamana ni gunai karmani sarvasha ahankara vimudatma kartaham iti manyate the bewildered spirit soul under the direct influence of the three modes of material nature thinks himself the doer of activities that are in actuality carried out by nature and quote bhagavad gita 327 the source of this bewilderment is that the living entity thinks quote i am this body and quote Ishvara sarvabhutanam hride sharjuna tistiti brahmanyam sarvabhutani yantra rudrani mayaya In this verse the word yantra or quote machine and quote means that in any species of life we are traveling in bodies that are like machines provided by material nature sometimes we are moving to higher species sometimes to lower species but if by the mercy of the spiritual master in krishna one gets the seed of devotional service and cultivates it he can become free from the cycle of birth and death then his life is successful otherwise he has to travel up and down to different species of life becoming sometimes a blade of grass sometimes a lion and so forth 